Hey, it's Maria. I've been traveling for the last two months around Australia after the quest for Jackie Chan and then realizing I had a photo box in my bank account and going to find work and traveling across New South Wales uh, country for that. And now I'm back and last two days, two, three days ago, I was in Melbourne working with the UK Productions and also Song Jay, who's a very talented uh, Melbourne-based guerrilla gun-ho filmmaker. And we got together, we jammed, and we made a short film in a day called Bullies. And I got a chance to work with a bunch of uh, aspiring you know, actors, stunts people, and performers, and that was fun. So um, check out some of the behind the scenes footage right here. Alright, the thing is, for those that don't know, this is a story about two, two students <coughs> who walk home from school and they get they come in an alleyway and get jumped by you guys. <laughs> Alright? And what happens is that you steal the DS and they want to get it back, so they fight you to get it back. And More accurately, she fights you. Special thanks to Chris Payne for letting me chill out here with you and also Richard Norton who is absolutely fabulous. Um, he's one of the old school um, martial artists, uh, actors, stunts person, fighters that uh, made a selection of films with Jackie Chan himself back in the old days. Um, so um, that was really cool to get a chance to pick his brains and figure out what it was like to on a Jackie Chan film set back in those days. Yeah. Uh. And also, big thanks to um, Daniel White, who has given me an opportunity to know more about his experiences uh, when he first met Jackie Chan as well, and also his journey into um, as an actor in the Australian film industry, and also some tidbits about what it's going to be like to be in Hong Kong. So, which I'm going to Hong Kong soon in about a couple of days. So it's going to be exciting. I'm sure it's going to be a bit of a culture shock, but um, hey man, I'm ready for anything. I'm Maria Tran. Mm.